no, seriously, what is going on here? Like, I switched out to Regigigas, and then it told me to pick another basic Pokemon, and as you can see, if I try to retreat out, Regigigas is still there, but he can't do anything, which is just odd. I don't know what's going on with that, but whatever. Anyways, this is a TCGO thing against this person called Bats My Lashes. And as you can see, their deck is full of nothing but EX cards, and, um, yeah. And I've been noticing that my deck is honestly just giving me terrible draws and everything else. And, among other things, I'm getting really crappy leads. I mean, I need to really get rid of these stupid Grimers. These are the worst Grimers in the entire format right now. So I'm going to go for the Dual Ball, get the two heads, and I'm going to take my... EX and my Darmanitan, Darmaka rather, because as you can imagine, wait a minute, am I even recording? Yes, I am. Okay, sorry, I wasn't sure. Um, going to go to Darmaka, going to bring out the Regigigas on the bench, and now I've got to decide what I want to do. I decide to just get some energy because I want to make sure that I can uh, hopefully get a Darmanitan startup because I do have one in my hand. So I'm hoping that eventually my Grimer is going to be KO'd and then I will have a decent Darmanitan set up where I can hopefully do a lot of damage. Now I'm going to Oak out and get a new hand, which um, brings me to Darmanitan, which had I known that was going to happen, I probably would have done it earlier, but whatever. It doesn't really matter too much. It would have made me lose out on my Psychic Energies. I just had to check to see what it can do exactly because I keep forgetting exactly what these EX monsters can do. And as you can see, this person loves the EXs so much that they bought the Mewtwo EX thing. And they have the little card for their character to hold up. And it also looks like she's holding a figure of it, but it kind of looks like a beard. I didn't think about it while I was playing, but whatever. I'm going to go for that Pokeball. I'm going to not get heads because, honestly. And I'm going to get a Gardevoir, which... Um, and here's a big mistake. I should have played that double colorless on Regigigas, and of course I'm only going to get three heads because, honestly, my luck is the worst luck in the world. So, now I'm just hoping that they don't have any water energies because then they can kill me in one hit, but I also neglect to realize the fact that Glaciate, when it's used, lets you discard one of your opponent's special energies. So... A lot of stupid plays on my end. Now I'm going to oak out again because I really don't have anything I can do at the moment. And I'm going to draw a Curlia, which is great, but I kind of wish I still had the Gardevoir. Which is why this deck needs more of those kinds of cards. I mean, and they're me getting no heads because, you know, the, my luck is just the best in the world. And now I'm going to have my face wrecked in by a Regigigas. So yeah, also, for whatever reason, my nose has been running like crazy for I don't know how long now, but whatever. I'm going to go out to my Regigigas, and now the game's not going to glitch out. I'm going to put a Psychic Energy, and they have an entire deck of EXs, and there's a glitch, as far as I know, where when you have Gardevoir out, all of your energies for Psychics are kind of double Psychic Energies. So I was kind of hoping I could take advantage of that glitch, because honestly, I didn't stand much of a chance otherwise. But had I just had the double colorless on Regigigas, I would be okay, at least in some sense, because, I mean, I don't know, it depends on what they would have done. I don't know if they would have actually kept the Kyurem out or not if I hadn't, I don't know, I mean, it's, it's confusing. I don't know if they would have gone to their Regigigas if I didn't have the double colorless attached to Darmanitan, but whatever, I don't know. Also, as you can see, I have like the worst hand ever and every time I draw, and honestly, I just had to put stuff together because uh, as I've explained in earlier videos that I've apparently decided I'm not going to upload, I just don't have, I can only make decks with cards that I actually have. It's not that I'm a scrub or anything, even though I kind of am, but I'm just getting wrecked by their Regigigas, and now I'm just trying to go for the damage here because really I don't have anything else I can do. I want to die next turn regardless of what I do, so I'm just going to let them get the extra damage on me and they're going to be able to finish me off next turn, which sucks, but uh, whatever. So as you can see, they also have a Zekrom EX, which they're going to put back in their deck and get a Mewtwo out. And uh, my goodness. Mewtwo is a card that is ridiculous. Like you saw in that other video that I had in front of this one, 
my opponent had a Mewtwo that was loaded up on energies like mad. It was able to do like, it could have KO'd my Regigigas twice. It was doing like 260 damage. And with a Gardevoir on the same bench or whatever as a Mewtwo EX, I can imagine that that would only go worse. So now I'm just going to copycat out, hopefully get some double cuddles energy, which I do. But uh, that's not going to save me for too much, too long. And I have Prism Energy in my hand, so of course I'm going to end up wasting it because honestly I could have gone for the glitch thing with uh, Basculin, but they're going to switch their Regigigas out and put another EX on the bench, and they're going to go for the Fisherman and get the uh, three energies from their hand, to their hand rather. And I'm going to get hit by uh, the X Ball, I think it's called. Yeah, X Ball. And I keep running over my cords because whatever, you know. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to do 100 damage with a plus powered. I don't even know what that move's called. And now my headphones are stuck, so I guess I'm going to take them off. Hooray! Random knowledge you can use to make fun of me in the future. So now they're going to play a card that makes me take one of my cards back to my hand. And I should have taken Darumaka back. I took Basculin back. Had I taken Darmantan back. I might, I mean, Narmaka back, I might have actually had a chance to win this, but uh, I don't have a chance at all because Basculin, even though I know it's a glitch, if you have a special energy on Basculin, the Baird Fangs does 80 damage and that would have been enough to kill Mewtwo, and as you can see, they're on their last prize, and as you can see, Mewtwo is their pride and joy, and I honestly don't know why they went for the 120 damage there, but whatever, I'm going to be dumb and just do that and then I want to forfeit because whatever so yeah woulda coulda shoulda and uh, everything else I know people shouldn't really complain about stuff like that but whatever I mean I don't have any more card codes and I don't have any will to buy any Pokemon cards because I'm not going to use them there's no sense in buying them and it would just be a net loss to me because the only thing I'm going to be doing is doing it for the card codes because I don't want to play League anywhere so anyways, that was me getting wrecked. That was like being a baby in a boxing match because you're not going to be able to do anything to your opponent. And that was also a lot like various other things. But I think the baby in a boxing match kind of sums that up very well. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed me getting destroyed by my opponent, even though I could have done some better plays. But sometimes you're just not thinking straight. <laughs>